it is like a Prasad Raj Prasad LLC. Today's date is July 30th, 2023. And uh, today's project is uh, in the chicken coop here. That's why I'm coming over here. Let me show you guys. Uh, you guys remember those little, these things I put up? Well, they didn't hold up as expected. Uh, the net and uh, the awnings all tearing up. As you can see, it's all hanging really low. So uh, I'm going to figure out a way to, not, well, yeah, to put that up. So with uh, hopefully uh, just uh, some piece of equipment, I'm trying to remove some of these rocks here because I got I to gotta make room. So the coop this way is uh, 15 feet. That way is 24 feet. So I ended up buying these bars here. So uh, these these here and they're a little hot right now here are gonna go across the top to support them and then this one here i'm gonna put in the middle to uh support that bar going across so and uh you guys see that bar over there so that's six feet so i'll put it just on this side of it so just a little shy of six, six feet on there and I just bought one right now to test it out, see how it's going to work, and then uh, we'll go from there. So uh, let me get uh, let me get those bars, put them in here, run them across the floor so I can measure, and then uh, cut them, and then put them up, and we'll go from there. So let me get set up, and uh, we'll go from there. All right, for the next part, I did was put the poles down here on the floor, just like so. And uh, then I'm going to do is uh, just uh, huh, I'm going to have my tripod here set up incorrectly somewhat but that's fine i'll figure it out right now so then all i'm gonna do is uh come here and mark where i need to cut it which will be right about here so these here have a little dip in them where you uh put the pole in so it's kind of where i went to so let me uh, go set this one up to go get cut and uh, we'll be right back. All right, so I pretty much have everything set up. I just gotta put my uh, bar on here to get cut. And then we should be able to go from there. Where is my mark? There it is right there. Uh. You guys can see I'm wearing glasses and uh, a hat and flip-flops because it's trying to be a little bit safe. All right, let's see. It's going to get a little loud. That right there, probably uh, besides digging the hole, was probably one of the hardest parts of this project. So uh, let's go get set everything up so we can uh, put this up and we'll go from there. All right, so this next part, I'm going to use uh, these, I don't know what they're called. I'll look at the name and I need to get know, but uh, I don't you guys can see or how good it's going to come out. But this just kind of clamps on here. And then uh, should be able to just uh, tighten it enough that it's gonna hold it. So let me. Uh, hmm. I wonder if I could uh, get the other side here. 
So there's a brace rail clamp is what this is called. So let me uh, see about putting this other side on over here. Just got to make sure it's kind of uh, almost the same in the same spot. The only good thing is that uh, this one over here I could actually slide to make sure it's in the same spot. Uh, come on. So yeah, the netting's already in the way. I was wearing my hat in here, but the freaking top gets getting caught in the netting, so I took it off. So all right, let's uh, let's uh, see if I can't. I'm hoping I can put this up before I have to uh, do the the bottom pole, but we shall find out. It's uh, really not too bad of a project, but we'll see how easily this goes up, if it goes up. So, all right, so I slid in the sidebar over there. Let me, uh, I'm gonna try to put this side in first. Hopefully I don't have to unscrew it to do it. Looks like I am, but well, it's gotta come off. All right, maybe I don't have to unscrew it too much. Just, uh, just a little bit maybe. Let's see. Here, let me kind of. I had it all together, but I decided to take it apart, make it maybe make it a little bit easier. So, there's a side I cut right here. So, I'm going to put it in here just to kind of hide a little bit of it. All right, I got that screwed in somewhat. See, all right, that's what I was hoping I'd be able to do. Now, hopefully, I don't know that's going to come out right here. Uh, put this in. I don't know if that came out on camera or not. But, all right, so I have that side in there. Let me uh, bring you guys back over here. I know, sorry, a lot of movement, huh? It's funny because it looks like it might be a little short. But is it? No, it's not. All right, so I'm going to have to take this off though maybe to get it in there so let me do that real quick then this goes in just like so and then bam all right and it's bowing a little bit in the middle which i expected but uh, let's see. Grab my. It's right here. Right, here we go. Got to make sure we get this the right way. I'm also, uh, this video here I'm shooting on my phone. I haven't uh, shot video on my phone in a while. The only reason is. Oh, shit, I was going the wrong way. So much for Raggy Taggy Lefty Lucy, huh? But, uh, anyways, the, uh, I'm experimenting. I bought a little, uh, I guess I could call it a microphone. Uh, just to see how that works. So, guys, let me know if, uh, you like that better or prefer I go back to the camera. I know, uh, probably here isn't making too much of a difference, but once I, um, like maybe for beehive inspections, it'll make a difference just cause uh, I know my bee suit, I know uh, some people say it sounds a little muffled or hard to hear. So we'll have to see how that works out. But all right, so this one's pretty much in here as tight as it's gonna go. Let me see if I can get it a little bit tighter. All right, let me, uh, do the other one you can see it's bowing down a little bit 
but look it's clear off my head so I like it next thing I'm gonna do is uh probably right here in the middle I'm gonna put the pole but uh I'll do that let me tighten this side up here first and then uh I'll get set up to do that and we'll go from there but yeah I think this is gonna work out perfect for me it's gonna I could either uh take those uh poles down there the ones I have right now that uh, I was originally using for the netting I'll probably take those down and uh I don't know, I'll figure something out with them, do something else with them. But uh, let me go grab my drill bit and the one that's going to go here and uh, get set up for that, and we'll go from there. All right, so I got my hole dug. It's right there. It's uh, I use my uh, auger to dig it up. The one that goes on my drill bit, I figured you guys didn't need to see video of me uh, digging a hole. So I just dug it beforehand. And uh, I'm going to put my fence pole in. Now this is a 7 foot fence pole. My chicken coop. The height on it is only uh, 6 feet. So I went a little bit less than uh, a foot down. And the reason being is I kind of wanted to be able to lift this up a little bit. Just like so. To be able to uh, give it a little bit of, of height. Oh, shit, you know what? The, I don't think these are going to... Oh, shit, without going the actual full foot. Hold on. I'm going to have to uh, put a gap somewhere in between here to make sure that uh, this actually goes up. Or not goes up, but that this actually uh, secures how we want it to. So it looks like I'm gonna have to go a little bit deeper on my hole than I wanted to, but just it was hard to get in there and uh, get the the drill in there. Unless I cut it, which I don't want to. Although it does have these holes on the side, I wonder if I can just. Uh, Drill them in. Oh, it's so freaking hot out here today. Let's see. I could probably push this up a little bit more, you know. Give it just a little. Let's do this. Hold on. Let me uh, put you off to the side. Let me just screw this in a little bit, see if I can't, uh, just to leave a big enough gap that it'll, uh, it'll go in. Yeah, I think this pole might actually be too big here, which means I'm going to have to uh, probably go with the smaller poles. I think this is going to be too big. All right, so this pole is going to be too thick. So I'm going to have to, uh, uh, let me go see what I have and figure something out. All right, so I found a pole. Uh, well, I didn't find a pole. What I did was uh, this one here that I cut, I just used that one. And I had another piece there because that was only five feet. Cut down to six and a half. So made a little bit of a uh, more uh room for it but uh yeah so it's up there Woo. almost lost you guys there for a minute so uh let me uh put this last piece on and then uh we should be good to go all right let's see i uh, see yeah the net's getting stuck on this because it's uh the part that got cut up here All right. Oh, shoot. I hope I have the screw. Yes, yes, I do. It's not one thing, it's another. But, uh, all right, so let me uh, lift that up, make sure that goes in there how it needs to. All right. So then 
let me bury this here. So, let me make sure that's straight and then tighten it. So, all right. See, ah, freaking net. Now with this here, I don't know this is the wrong size. It's not really, it looks like it's just kind of, oh, there it goes. I guess it just wasn't at that point yet. Huh? All right, so let me bury this down here. And uh, so what I'm gonna do now is uh, now that I know what I need, it's, uh, I'm guessing I'll probably need, I'll probably put the next one right here, uh, right here, just right before the pole here to bring this one up. And then the next one after that, I'll bring up to here. And the good thing here is I could actually cut it a little bit short because of the coop there. So if I have a little bit of overhang, I should be good. Whew, scaring all the chickens. I'll just have it come up to hit here. So I have to measure from uh, here to uh, the fence over there. So I could just measure the the length of the coop too and then deduct that, but I'll figure it out. But uh, So I need at least one, two, at least two more uh, setups for this. So I got to go calculate exactly how much it's going to cost to let the wife know and then show her how this looks here because I think once she sees how this looks here she'll be okay with it and uh so I end up buying one two three four so five pieces if this would worked here it would have been uh the same five pieces but I gotta buy one more just because I gotta be able to extend that part out at the bottom there which isn't that big of a deal because I'm gonna need one two three at least four Four more poles. I'll buy five just to be on the safe side. Uh, five of these, and then I'm gonna need one, two, three, four, five, and then five more of these here. So we should be good. And then uh, with this party too, what I like is even the future, if I want to, I can. Um, I have uh, some chain link fence on the side over there. So I'm thinking if I grab some more of these poles here and just throw them across this way, maybe one here, one on that side, just for extra support, I could actually throw a chain link over it. And give it a little bit more uh, security and stuff but uh i'm going to calculate how much this costs i'm going to talk to the wife uh if she's okay with it then i'll go purchase everything else i need to finish this up and then i'll show you guys the end result once it's done all right well it's august 23rd and i finally got these all done as you can see it still hangs down a little bit i just got to come through and either secure these somehow up here which is stupid because they're just going to rip again and as you can see, this storm really put a big hole right here. So we'll see. And then I just kind of stretched it out and used a clip here to hold it. Because, of course, it ripped here also. But uh, eventually, I'll probably end up throwing uh, bars going across this way. And then I'll probably just throw some chain link fence over it. But I mean, it's a lot better, easier to come in. Don't have to duck down as much. So, oh, And then one thing I also didn't do is I didn't bother. Bother. To bury these, I was too lazy to dig holes and and bury those. You see, these are just kind of on the ground. This one's a little bit more because it's not attached to anything. It just kind of goes up over the roof here and does that. But it's done. So that's it for this video here. Uh, any suggestions or anything? Uh, feel free to leave in the comments and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe.